Thank you. A local family coping with unimaginable pain tonight. News 4 now knows the teenager killed on 170 overnight was seven months pregnant. State troopers tell us just before 1230 this morning, Shalia Hamblin was riding her bike northbound on the interstate. A car hit the 19 year old near Forest Park Parkway and then took off. News 4's Jenna Ray is near that crash site tonight with the family's plea to find that driver. Jenna. Sam, they have so many questions tonight, and that's coming straight from family members who I talked to earlier today. However, right now, their priority is finding out exactly who is responsible for hitting and killing Shalia Hamblin and leaving her on the side of this highway behind me. She was a very happy spirit. Walk, she walked in the room, lighted up. <laughs> she was the sweetest person you could ever meet. Um, she just was a person that would give you the shut off right back if she could. That's how everyone describes Shalia Hamblin. My niece is like my baby. My daughter, she was an angel from heaven. Family tells News 4 Shalia worked at the McDonald's in Brentwood and was on her way home. She just uh, got a promotion and she just became a manager at McDonald's. Yes, she was. Uh, I guess she was closing the store down. I was just thinking about like, dang, it was 12 o'clock in the morning getting struck from behind from a car. They tell me Interstate 170 was not her typical route home and say they believe she was just trying to take the fastest way. Very hard working. She was so excited about being a manager and she just was happy and she was getting prepared to have her baby and it just happened to a song. Just graduated from high school. Yes, on a roll. Clua High School just graduated. Right now, no one's been arrested or taken into custody for this incident. And Shalia's family has a message for the person out there who hit and killed her and her unborn baby. You turn yourself in, I will appreciate you turn yourself in because it will help me out more not to be stressed. Yeah. And may God bless you and get yourself together. Whatever you're doing, you need to pray to God about that because that's wrong what you did for my daughter. Please come forward. I just want you to turn yourself in. In just about an hour, Shalia's family is celebrating her life in a balloon release happening in Brentwood. For now, highway patrol officers are still looking again for that person responsible. They do have a description of a car. That's a Chevy Camaro. They don't have a color description right now or a description of a person of interest. However, if you have any information or know anything at all that happened on this highway early this morning, we're told that you should be calling local police live in St. Louis County tonight. Jenna Ray, News 4. Jenna, just a heartbreak.